Namaste Arunachal Pradesh. This is the state that carries the rushing water of Kameng, Subhanshiri, Lohit, Siang and Tirap. This is the state of the great Moji Reba who with grit led the people against the British government in India. This is the state of Anshu Jamsempa, the incredible woman who is the first woman in the world to scale the summit of Mount Everest twice in a season and the fastest double summiter to do so within five days. This is the state of the peaceful breeze of Tawang. And we are certain that we will get quizzing talent who would climb the Everest of quizzing from Arunachal Pradesh. We welcome you to the Fit India Quiz Arunachal Pradesh edition presented by Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports and Ministry of Education with Fit India mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav is an initiative of the Government of India to celebrate and commemorate 75 years of progressive India and the glorious history of its people, culture and achievements. Fit India Quiz is the biggest Indian quiz on sports and fitness like none other. The Fit India Quiz provides an opportunity to students and schools to win cash prizes of rupees 3.25 crore and be the champion at state and national level. In the preliminary round, 36,299 students from 13,502 schools participated in the mobile-based test conducted by the National Testing Agency. Participation was from more than 626 districts across India. After the preliminary rounds, 360 schools will be participating in the state web rounds where they will be competing with the selected schools from their respective state or union territories to become state or union territory champions and represent their state or union territory in the national finals. So without any further delay, let's go to our virtual auditorium to meet our quiz master for today. Hello and welcome to the semi-final round of the Arunachal Pradesh edition of Fit India Quiz. Let us go and meet the participants in this round. But before we do that, I would like the participants to know that the top two teams for this round will qualify to represent your respective schools and state in the state grand finale. With that, let us have the introductions to the teams. Team one, please introduce yourselves. Sir Sunno Wange representing Kendri Vidyale Tengabe. representing Kendri Vidyale Tengabe. Welcome to this round. Team one, if you could tell us who is your favorite sports person? Cristiano Ronaldo. Wonderful. He's such an iconic player, a player of global fame who has inspired thousands and perhaps millions of people to take to football. Team two, let us have your introduction. Hello, everyone. We both are representing KV number two, Itanagar. Could we have your names? Yes, sir. My name is Atanjit Kumar. And my name is Pankita Bora. Wonderful. Team two, if you could tell us, how do you keep up your fitness? Do you have any particular activity that you pursue? By jogging and exercising. Wonderful. Great way to stay fit. Team three, please introduce yourselves. So we are representing Jesus Crossing in Kyung. Do we also have your names? Yeah, Benjamin Tang. And Michael Balagia. Welcome to this round, Team 3. Team 3, tell us which is the sport that is closest to your hearts? Football. Football it is. Indeed, I yeah. think it is uh, closest to the hearts of millions of people across the globe. Team 4, please introduce yourselves. Could you also give us your names? My name is Surya My name is Dubya Dhanu. Wonderful. Tell us, what is the fitness routine that you generally follow? Jogging. Great. I think jogging is a great way to stay fit. Welcome to this round. So before we move forward, let us now meet the expert for the day. Our expert for the day is Mr. Kaushik Roy. Hello, uh, welcome all the students here for this session of quiz. I'll be there to help you out in case you need any assistance and uh, wish all the students the best of luck. Welcome Mr. Roy. You yeah, are the captain you. fit for this round. Yeah, thank you. Let us now go to the rounds. 
We begin with round one, which is fitness kiddos, inspired by our Prime Minister's great saying, fitness kiddos aadha ghanta rose. Let us have a look at the rules for round one. Fitness kiddos. Questions on yoga, fitness and nutrition. Clockwise round. Direct question to each team. The question will not pass. Correct answer will fetch 10 points. And if lifeline is used, correct answer will fetch 5 points. No negative marking. Lifelines are available. Quizmaster's decision is final. Round 1. And before I ask the questions, I would request all the teams to be staying focused on the screen and to give your answers loud and clear. All right. So here's the question and I'm, the question goes to team one. Your question. This exercise is great for back pain. Name this exercise. A. Superman. B. Spider-Man. C. Batman. Or D. Iron Man. Your time starts now. So Superman. Team one says Superman. Let us have a look at the answer. Absolutely right. That's a fair answer. It is Superman. Well done, team one. Let's move to team two. Your question on the screen. The word yog is derived from the Sanskrit root word. Tell us that word. Is it A, jug? Or B, is it tug? C, yug? Or D, mug? Your time starts now. Uh, C, yug. Team 2 says C, yug. Let us have a look at the answer. Yug it is. It is the perfectly fit answer to the question. Well done, Team 2. Question to Team 3. Your question is, find the odd one out. A. Calcium. B. Phosphorus. C. Folic acid. D. Sodium. Your time starts now. D. Sodium. Team 3 says D. Sodium. Let us have a look at the answer. Oh, Team 3, you've not got that right. The fair answer would have been folic acid. Let's go over to Team 4. Your question is, name the asana in which the waist and the arms look like a cobra pose. A. Vakrasana B. Kakasana C. Bhujangasana or D. Nakasana Your time starts now. Team 4 says C. Bhujangasana. Let's have a look at the answer. You have the fit answer to the question. Congratulations. It is indeed C. Bhujangasana. Well, with that, we come to the end of round one. We will take a short break and get back to you with the score. Fit India quiz mein desh ke kone kone se bhaag lene wale sabhi vidyarthiyon ka mein abhinandan karta hu aur aasha karta hu ki aap sabhi ji jaan lagayenge jeetne ke liye khelenge fit india quiz mein bhaag lenge aur apne vidyalay parijanon ayam rajya ka naam roshan karenge aapko dhero shubhkamnaye jai hind jai bharat to the semi-final round of the Arunachal Pradesh edition of Fit India Quiz presented by the Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports, the Ministry of Education with Fit India Mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. Fit India Quiz is the biggest Indian quiz on sports and fitness. Now let us have a look at the scores. Well, at the end of round one, team three is yet to open the account. but. Team 1, 2 and 4 are hair head with 10 points apiece. Well, the competition is very close. I think it's great action to look forward to in the coming rounds. We now move to round 2, which is called the Champion of Champions. Let's have a look at the rules. Champion of Champions. Questions on Indian sports personalities. Each clue on the buzzer. There will be three clues to guess the answer. 
Each clue will fetch 15, 10 and 5 points respectively. The question will not pass. Wrong answer will fetch minus 5 points. No additional lifelines for this round. Quizmaster's decision is final. We are about to begin round 2, which is the champion of champions. And please be aware that this is a buzzer round. You have to have your finger on the buzzer. And when you answer the question, please be loud and clear and quick. So here is the first question coming your way. She is an Indian weightlifter born in Kaching Kunal in the Kaching district of Manipur. She's a two-time Commonwealth Games champion. Let's move to the second clue. She holds the Commonwealth Games record for 84 kgs for the snatch segment. She won her second successive gold medal at the 2018 Commonwealth Games in Australia. Let me give you the third clue, the visual clue. Well, we don't have the answer from any of the teams, so I'll give you the answer. The fit answer would have been Kumukcham Sanjita Chanu. Let's now go to question number two. He is a badminton player from Assam. He represented India at many international tournaments, including at the Barcelona and Atlanta Olympics. He's a mentor of the Indian Collegiate Athletic Program for the sport of badminton. Here is a second clue for you. He was called the Indian national badminton champion thrice and a runner-up twice. At the Barcelona Olympics, he reached the pre-quarter final stage. Here is a third clue for you, the visual clue. Name this player. All right, we don't have the answers from you. Let me give you the answer. It is none other than Dipankar Bhattacharya. Question number three, finger on the buzzer. Here is the question. She shot to stardom after the Rio Olympics. Hailing from Agartala, Tripura and born on the 9th of August, 1993, she's the first ever Indian woman gymnast to compete in the Olympics. All right, we have an answer from team one. Deepak Karmakar. Team one says Deepak Karmakar. Let's have a look at the answer. It is indeed Deepa Karmakar. Very well done. All the points come to you. Let us go to question number four. Here's the question. She won the ICC Women's Player of the Year Award in 2007 and the M.H. Dambram Trophy for Best Women's Cricketer in 2011. Clue number two. She is the highest wicket taker in women's one day international cricket. All right, here comes clue number three, the visual clue. All right, we don't have the answers from you. Let me give you the answer. The fit answer to this question would have been Julan Goswami. Well, with that, we come to the end of round two. Let us take a short break and we'll get back to you with the scores. Fit rehna utna muskil kaam nahi hai jitna kuch logon ko lagta hai. Fitness ki dose aadha ghanta roj. इस मंत्र में सभी का स्वास्थ्य सभी का सुख छिपा हुआ है Welcome back to the semi-finals round 
of the Arunachal Pradesh edition of Fit India Quiz presented by the Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports, the Ministry of Education with Fit India Mission in celebration of Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav. And our Honorable Prime Minister could not have said in a better way how important is fitness in our lives. And I quote, fitness ki dose aadha ghanta roz. Let us now get to the score sheet at the end of round two. Team three is yet to open the account, but you have two more rounds to catch up. Team two and team four are currently tied at 10 points and team one is leading with 25 points. Well done. Round three. Round three is called Bharat Ke Khel. Let us have a look at the rules. Bharat Ke Khel. Questions on traditional Indian sports. Anti-clockwise round. Direct questions to each team. No passing. Correct answer will fetch 10 points. And if lifeline is used, correct answer will fetch 5 points. No negative marking. Lifelines are available. Quizmaster's decision is final. Ready for round three, Bharat Ke Khel. Here is question one, and I go to team four. Team four, your question is In the game of Hole Taso Dukanaram, what kind of an animal is a Hole Taso? A. Cat, B. Dog, C. Dragon, or D. Fish? Your time starts now. Team 4 says C Dragon. Let us have a look at the answer. Oh, you don't get the points there? The fit answer would have been A Cat. Let's go to Team 3 now. Your question. In this game, the contestant has to hold one leg in his hand and place the other hand on his shoulder and has one leg to hop on and achieve his objective of pushing his opponent out of the circle. Name the game. A. Porok B. Dhupkel C. Insuknavar or D. Cockfighting Your time starts now. Team 3 says D. Cockfighting Let us see if that is the right answer. Oh, unfortunately, you have not got that right. The fit answer to that question is Parok. Now, the question goes to team two. And your question is, this is a game of bamboo stick walking and is popular amongst the tribes in Arunachal Pradesh. Name the game. A. Pole Vault B. Chocho C. Hinam Turnam or D. Duck, dal, duck, asunam. Sir, we want to take. Now. Sir, we want to take help. All right. Team two wants to take the helpline. Please tell us which helpline would you want to opt for. Toss the question. All right. Team two, here is the question for you. Vijay Hazare Trophy is related to which sport? Badminton. Team 2 says badminton. Let's have a look at the answer. Oh, it's not badminton. The fit answer is cricket. I would like to give the answer to the question that was tossed. The question was, it is a game of bamboo stick walking and is popular among the tribes in Arunachal Pradesh. Name the game. And the answer is Duck Dal Dakasunam. Now let me turn to team one. And your question is The local people call it the struggle of life and death. In this game, the participants assume the role of the hunter and the hunted in the forest. What is this game called? 
ए हिनाम तुरनाम बी होले तासो दुकन आराम सी यू बी लकपी और डी के नाम हुआ योर टाइम स्टार्ट नाउ So we want to use the lifeline. Team one wants to use the lifeline. Please tell us which lifeline would you want to opt for? So we want to call the expert. All right. Team one wants to speak with Captain Fit. Please go ahead. Yes, it is Hinam uh, Tornam. Team one, let's have the answer from you. Hinam Tornam, sir. Team one says the answer is A. Hinam Tornam. Let's have a look at the answer. It is Hinam Tornam. I think you've used the lifeline very well. Congratulations for getting this good answer. Well, with that we come to the end of round three. But before we get the scores over to you, let us take a short break. फिट इंडिया क्विज में देश के कोने कोने से भाग लेने वाले सभी विद्यार्थियों का मैं अभिनंदन करता हूं और आशा करता हूं कि आप सभी जी जान लगाएंगे जीतने के लिए खेलेंगे फिट इंडिया क्विज में भाग लेंगे और अपने विद्यालय परिजनों एवं राज्य का नाम रोशन करेंगे आपको ढेरों शुभकामनाएं जय हिंद जय भारत Welcome back to the semi-final round of the Arunachal Pradesh edition of Fit India Quiz presented by the Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports the Ministry of Education with Fit India Mission in celebration of Azadi ka Amrit Mahotsav Fit India Quiz is the biggest Indian quiz on sports and fitness now let's have a look at the scores at the end of round 3 team 3 is yet to open the account but you have round 4 where you can score big and catch up team 2 and team 4 are tied with 10 points each and team 1 is leading with 30 points now that brings us to round 4 which is called freestyle Let us have a look at the rules. Freestyle. Sports mixed bag questions. 12 questions on the buzzer. Correct answer will fetch each team 10 points. Minus 5 for wrong answer after buzzer. No additional lifelines for this round. Quiz master's decision is final. We are on to round 4. This is a buzzer round where you have to be quick, you have to be loud and you have to be clear. Stay focused. Here is the first question for you. The old name of table tennis is Team One. Yes, your answer. Ping pong. Team One says ping pong. Let us have a look at the answer. Ping pong, it is. It is a fit answer. Well done. Question number two. How many players are there in a team for a volleyball game? Team 2. 11. Team 2 says 11. Let's have a look at the answer. Oh, it's not 11, it is 6. You lose some points there. Question number 3. In badminton, a shot hit softly and with finesse to fall rapidly and close to the net on the opponent side is called a team 2 smash team 2 says smash let us have a look at the answer it is drop shot well let us move to the next question the question is during lockdowns in 2020 Fit India Mission celebrated the International Yoga Day on the 21st of June with an online event. 
which well-known personality had anchored that event? All right, we don't have the answer from you. Let me share the answer. It is Shilpa Shetty. Question number five. An unsuccessful serve that occurs by the ball landing out of bounds, failing to clear the net, or a foot fault from the server in volleyball is called... Well, I don't get the answer from the teams, so let me give you the answer. The fit answer to that question is... Service error. Let us go to the next question. Polo is also called the sport of... Okay, I don't get the answer. Let me help you with the answer there. It would have been Kings. Question number seven. There are two levels of boxing. What are they? All right, I don't have the answers again from the teams. The answer is the two levels, the amateur level of boxing and the professional level of boxing. Question number eight. When was Fitness Kido's Ada Gantaro's clarion call launched? Okay, let's move on. Let me give you the answer to this question. It was in the year 2020. The next question for you. In football, the half time is how many minutes long? Team 3. Team 3, go ahead with your answer. Two minutes. Two minutes. Let's have a look at the answer. It's 15 minutes. Oh, you stand to lose a few points there. Question number 10. When was the Fit India movement launched? Team 3. 29th August 2019. 29th August, August 2019. Let us have a look at the answer. 29th August 2019 is indeed the fair answer to that question. 29th August 2019 is also the National Sports Day. Very well done. The next question. Where was the first one-day international match in India held? Team 3. Bhupaneshwar. Team 3 says Bhubaneshwar. Let's have a look at the answer. Oh, unfortunately, that is not the right answer. The fit answer to that question is Sardar Vallabhai Patel Stadium, Ahmedabad. We now move to the final question of this round. Question number 12. What is the area between the wickets in a cricket ground called? Okay, team one. The pitch. Team one says pitch. And the answer is pitch indeed. That is the fit answer to the question. Very well done. And with that, we come to the end of round four. Let us take a short break. And then I'll come to you with the final scores. लाइफ में चैलेंजेस कभी भी और कहीं भी आ सकते हैं और हम इनका अच्छे से तभी सामना कर सकते हैं जब हम तैयार हों इनको फेस करने के लिए हम अगर हेल्दी और फिट हैं तो हमारी तैयारी और भी बेहतर हो जाती है बस जरूरत है थोड़ी सी मेहनत थोड़े से अनुशासन की प्रेजेंटिंग फिट इंडिया मोबाइल ऐप आपका फिटनेस गाइड और पर्सनल हेल्थ ट्रेनर पहली बार अब भारत का हर एक नागरिक अपना फिटनेस कोर पता करके जान पाएगा कि वो कितना फिट है 
आप अपनी आयु के अनुसार अपने फिटनेस स्कोर की जांच कर सकते हैं ये सुविधा खास आपके लिए पहली बार शुरू की जा रही है ये ऐप आपके फिटनेस रूटीन को ट्रैक कर सारा डेटा स्टोर करता है ताकि आप अपनी प्रोग्रेस देख सके और फिट रहने के नए और आसान नुस्खे अपना पाए इस ऐप के साथ आप बन सकते हैं खुद के फिटनेस मास्टर उसके बाद हम आपके फिटनेस रूटीन को बनाने में आपकी मदद करेंगे फिटनेस की दुनिया में कदम रखें मोटिवेटेड रहें और अपडेटेड रहें। और सबसे अच्छी बात है कि इन सारी सुविधाओं का लाभ आप पा सकते हैं एकदम फ्री बस अपने एंड्रॉइड और एप्पल डिवाइस पर हमारे ऐप का हिंदी और इंग्लिश वर्जन डाउनलोड करें और शुरू हो जाइए आपका फिट रहने का सपना अब है एक क्लिक दूर फिटनेस की डोज आधा घंटा रोज Welcome back to the semi-finals of the Arunachal Pradesh edition of Fit India Quiz presented by the Ministry of Youth Affairs and Sports the Ministry of Education with Fit India mission in celebration of Azadi ka Amrit Mahotsav Before we move on to see the scores let me just remind you that you too can download the Fit India app from the Play Store or App Store and be fit every minute every day And now we move on to that part of the episode which the audiences have been waiting for the Fit India daily quiz question The process to participate in this quiz is very simple I will ask a question related to sports and fitness all that you have to do is to log in to the Fit India mobile app and answer the question in the Fit India daily quiz section the user who gives the correct answer in the quickest time will win a fit india merchandise also some of the lucky winners will stand a chance to be in the grand finale of the fit india quiz just download or update the fit india mobile app which is india's most comprehensive fitness app offering features like generating your fitness score customized diet plans steps tracker calorie tracker sleep tracker and much more And the biggest advantage is that you can use all of these features for absolutely free which is being provided to you exclusively by Fit India mobile app. Right. So here is a question for the audiences. And the question is This football club had won 42 consecutive matches in 1994 season to record the longest sequence of wins in the indian football history a dempo sports club b east bengal c mohan bagan or d churchill brothers now let us have a look at the final scores of this round the scores are team 3 could not open the account team 2 scored 5 points team 4 scored 10 points and team 1 scored 50 points to emerge as the top team in this particular round <laughs> at the same time let me congratulate team 1 and team 4 for having qualified to the state grand finale with this we come to the close of the semi final round of the arunachal pradesh edition of fit india quiz a big thank you to the ministry of youth affairs and sports and the ministry of education for giving us all and especially the children of india the opportunity to be on a platform like this this is me rajiv ragunath signing off And don't forget the magical mantra given to us by our Prime Minister: "Fitness ki dose, aadha ghanta rose." And our coordination team will get in touch with the two teams that have qualified to brief you for the next round. Thank you so much for being here. <laughs>